Hey guys, welcome to another episode of The Bow Show. It's The Bow Show, baby. Today, I have a very special guest, Mr. Jonathan Kozub, the official photographer for the Winnipeg Jets. Johnny, thanks for coming on the show. Appreciate it. Good to, have you. Good to be here. <laughs> You're right on the ice for uh, right before the game, uh, the national anthem's there. What's that like? Hey, you know what? It's really, really crazy. Yeah. You got the environment. You can't even put it into words. Yeah. It's more feeling. Mm-hmm. You know, when the team comes out there and it's just like, it's white noise. That's what it is. <laughs> and you know what? You're getting pumped up too when the team's coming out. And it's You're just at. like, my ears were sore for two days after that. <laughs> I swear, I'm not making this up. And uh, yeah, it's, you know what? When the team comes out, it's just, you can't hear anything. And I tried wearing earplugs, but when you wear earplugs, it you, you lose the effect. Like yeah. you gotta hear it live, right? And uh, but yeah, it's just really cool. And the players are pumped, and That's, everybody's just focused, and it, it's a yeah. real neat experience. Winnipeggers are special to have this. What's the toughest photo you've ever taken? Guys say all the time they say, "Bo, when you used to play for the Pistons, or when you played at Liberty, it's tough to take pictures because your boots are moving so quick." I said, "Well, what do you expect? I'm not gonna slow <laughs> down. You know what I mean?" Yeah. So what's the toughest photo you've ever taken? It's more about moments that are, yeah. that are tough to get because you only get one shot at it. Sure. So like we're talking maybe a, an overtime goal, so, something where you know you got to be ready and if you blink and you look away you miss it. Yeah. Those are the toughest shots to take. Hits are okay too if you're watching. If you want to get a really big hit like a you know buff nail on somebody into the bench, that's uh, you got to be ready for those. Those are tough to get. Yeah. But uh, for the most part, it's those big moments. You got to stay focused because if you're not, you're gonna miss them. You would be considered a big dog. Most of the time on our show, we only say big dogs only. That's kind of becoming the motto here. We say, Bo Show Baby, in brackets, big dogs only. No small dogs allowed. (laughs) Has anybody ever asked for your autograph? Yes. So growing up, I used to collect hockey cards, and I know a lot of the the boys did too. Nowadays, you're the one taking the pictures that are going on the Jets hockey cards. Yeah, yeah, that's... You know what? I was the same as you. I grew up collecting cards. I mean, back in the day when there was like one or two companies. Now, yeah. well, now it's one company anyway, but it's a lot. There's all kinds of sets. It's amazing, you know? That's unreal. Yeah. I feel like I'm in the midst of a legend right now. Yeah. Behind the scenes. It's all about guys behind the scenes. That's what the Bull Show's about. <laughs> it's big dogs who are behind the scenes, yeah. baby. Now, yeah. as a pro photographer, yeah. what are your thoughts on selfies? <laughs> People who know me are going to say I'm the... Like, what do you call it? Sergeant Selfie, Captain Selfie, I don't know. I'm capturing all these moments. Yeah. What, well, at the end of the day, I'm not I'm not in the photo. That's right. So now I'm a little more open to taking selfies. When we look at you coming into the rink before the games, Johnny's coming in, guy's got his <laughs> camera, he's got his lens belt. Yeah. He's got the whole setup. Do you have any pre-game rituals? Uh, you try to get some rest best you can, yeah. but uh, mostly just make sure everything is charged up day of the game. Like usually I charge the night before. Yeah. Don't charge anything the day of. Never. Have no, everything's charged, ready. Laptop's good to go. Yeah. Folders, files are ready to go. And what uh, about the fingers? Now this has got to be my thing too yeah. because it's constantly. Could this be the one career where video games is actually a great training mechanism, kids? I'm telling you, Fortnite and Shell could now become great training mechanisms. Photographer, this is what you want your future to be. Got to work these muscles. See that right there? Look at that. <laughs> see? <laughs> that definition right there. That, look at you. You can see that yeah. muscle definition That's and that form. Look at the backwards. <laughs> Do I have what it takes to be a model for Jets gear? Oh, absolutely. We're always looking for fresh faces. Wow. Well, you know, oh, you got one right here whenever you need it, baby. Yeah, you should do it. And the thing is, is with the sh- with business booming right now, yeah. this face is one that people are going to know. Because, I mean, you look at the guys that are coming through in the neighborhood of the Bow Show, and bi- like I said, business is booming, and they're going to recognize it. That's right. They're going to see you, and it's like, hey, it's Jordan from the Bow Show. That's Let's the guy. Yeah, I know. That's that guy. And I like that hoodie, so I'm going to buy it. Right? There you go. See? But wait. Wait a second. Why is it so tired of... Why is he so tight on his chest and his arms? I'm, I'm gonna need two sides bigger than that. Hey, you know what? I, I, I don't know what to say about that. I know that there's pictures of people lurking. Can you think of any moment where it was a funny lurker moment? 
You know, there's always lurkers, actually. Constantly? You know what? Before Jets games, like when... After they hit the ice, yeah, uh, you know, for the intro, sure, they do their lap, whatever, and then they'll go on the bench for the anthem, right? Yeah. And every time I'm focusing on players on the bench, there's always a guy in the background. He's sitting like this, and he's like, looking at me. It is oh, it always happens. And I, I guaranteed every game you get a lurker. Guys, Jonathan Kozub, head photographer for our Winnipeg Jets. Johnny, thanks a lot for coming on the show. Thanks for having me. And Good thank you. you as well. And thank you guys for tuning in to another episode of the Bow Show. We'll see you next time. It's the Bo Show, baby!